Hey Capricorns and welcome back to Pure Black Magic. Emphasis on the pure, the black, and the magic. My name is Dee and I want to thank you guys for tuning back into the Card House series. This is going to be a quick pop-up message for you guys in regards to your energy, the energy within you and surrounding you, okay? So let's see what type of messages we get to come out for you all. Please keep in mind that this is a general reading so it may or may not resonate with you. Parts of the message can resonate, parts of it might not and that is totally okay. Okay, um, if you do like the content and you want to book a private reading with me, all of that information is going to be in the description box below. Also, if you would like to support and donate to the channel, it is greatly appreciated. You can do so via Cash App at Pure Black Magic. Okay, all right, Capricorn. So let's see all major Capricorn places sun, moon, rising, Venus, and north nodes. But I always just like to say, um, wherever you have Capricorn in your chart, if you are um, able to read charts or have someone to help you read your chart just apply it how you see fit okay so we have the hostilities card popping out all right so it could be some chaos and conflict going on in your energy and your environment we do have the angel of love at the bottom of the deck so this could definitely be pertaining to a romantic relationship okay you and your romantic interests are not seeing eye to eye i feel like you guys are at odds all right um I don't know i'm picking up a heavy energy of couples who live together so i'm getting the vibe that you're kind of like in the same space in the same living space and you guys are not on good terms you're not speaking to each other i feel like you're walking past each other kind of giving each other um like this mean mug this stare here so the energy is very awkward it's very much so um yeah awkward <laughs> that's all i'm feeling is that the energy is awkward between you and a romantic interest here okay let's see what else we get to come out for capricorns yeah i split the deck so at the bottom of the deck we have the mending card i kept seeing this constantly when i was shuffling pre-shuffling on your energy and then we have the loyal heart as well so um i kind of feel like you are wanting to mend a situation or the other person wants to mend a situation um because you are the other person or maybe both of you guys want to mend it because you're very loyal to each other but i don't know i feel like this is normal for you like one day you're on the next day you're off you guys kind of just get over it and move forward with your lives in the relationship so i feel like this isn't the first time it has happened honestly i feel like it's not going to be the last you guys are very committed to each other but you just i don't know i feel like you just get on each other's nerves so we have the blessed and we have the observer card okay hmm Ooh, and then at the bottom of the deck we have the fates so yeah i feel like like i said i don't feel like this is the first time i don't feel like and i really don't feel like it will be the last between you guys um i kind of just feel like you guys just argue over petty things a bump head bump heads over petty things and then eventually somebody breaks the silence or someone gets over it okay so you or the other person could just be um observing one another here i kind of just heard that you are watching or you need to be on the watch out for something okay this could be in regards to this particular relationship or situation or it could be in regards to something else um but i feel like your energy is more so the energy that does not say a lot or at least you're not saying a lot right now i feel like you are just trying to um i don't know you're just kind of going with the flow of things I feel like you're not saying a lot and I feel like your partner is like just is making them even more upset. Like it's really just grinding their gears that you have not addressed the situation. You're not talking to them. You guys live in the same living space. But I feel like it's just very petty energy. Like you guys kind of do this on a regular basis or you do this to get on, you know, your partner's nerves or they do it to get on your nerves. But in reality, you have the blessed card here. So I feel like you are kind of like acting like you're mad about a situation but deep down you're not really mad you're only acting mad just to get on this person's nerves or this person is doing this to you because i feel like you feel blessed in the situation i feel like you're overall happy um but you just like to see this person upset or angry or this person just likes to see you upset or angry with the fates card at the bottom of the deck i feel like this is faded okay this is some sort of weird crazy um mr and mrs smith type of relationship energy that i'm getting for you guys but i mean if you like it <laughs> i love it let's just see um hmm let's pull i wanted to pull a moon card but i am going to pull 
from a different oracle deck just to see what it has to say, what the outcome of this situation is going to be, or just any extra messages in regards to this message. Um, but I feel like there's a lot of love here. It's a lot of playful energy. It's, I don't know. I'm kind of picking up like it's a brother, sister type of relationship or a best friend type of relationship, um, along with you guys being romantic as well. It's really weird, but this is normal for you guys. Yeah. So we have a simplicity card coming out. Um, and then we have courage at the bottom of the deck. I'm not really too sure what this courage has to do with anything. Um, but with this simplicity card, this is just com confirmation for me, letting me know that this is like, this is nothing to you. This is something that happens every day, every other day, every week. You guys are mad at each other. Or you act like you're mad at each other. You do something to get on their nerves, vice versa. Like it's simple. Like it's nothing to you. I feel like you don't really take these situations to heart, but whoever else you're involved with, I feel like they are really heated. So you might want to lay off of the, um, <laughs> of the tricks or trying to just make this person mad. I feel like you get a kick out of that. Okay. Yeah, it's really strange, but this is your energy, Capricorn. Hopefully this helps. If it resonates, please, please leave me a message below letting me know how. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time.